Ask and you shall receive. This is your boy Pet. Welcome to Shout Out. Today on Shout Out, Minka loves pineapples. Alright, what to do tonight, people? This is your boy Pat, and welcome to another episode of Shout Out. Now, as you saw earlier, that was my boy named Dragon. <laughs> Talking about, yo, man, this is all nice and dandy, but can you actually shout out some people I'm not sub to already? Because, as you see in my earlier shout out, you know, the shout outs were basically the people who are already popular amongst the YouTube community. And that was me paying them back for it because they have already given me shout outs. And trust me, I still got future people who I have to shout out that NA is probably already sub, sub to. But I'm actually going, you know, um, you know, honor his request. And so, NA, all right. This is one of the shout outs I'm going to be throwing out right there. All right, check it out. Her name is Mika Loves Pineapple. She's new to the YouTube community. She just came on about a month ago. And, you know, how I really met her was I was on YouTube and I was watching like True Lives and I came upon an episode called True Life um, I Stutter. And after I got through watching that, you know how you get those recommendations, you know, on YouTube. They recommend certain videos. And so her video was one of the... Um, one of the most recommended so I checked her out and things like that you know and basically what it is from what I got to her you know she's a you know she's a renowned vegan who basically you know saw one of these videos where she you know saw how meat you know has been processed you know how animals are being killed in these slaughterhouses and things like that so she had a change you know she it hit her right in the heart so she had a change and now she's gone vegan so she spends a lot of her time in her videos talking about, you know, how she lives a vegan lifestyle and how it's being great for her, how it's healthier for her and things like that. And she gives inspiring stories. So to her, I say, you know, like Minka, you know, keep that up, you know, keep doing what you're doing to talk, I'm saying, keep talking about the vegan lifestyle in a positive way, you know, cause don't be like any of these, you know, negative, you know, um, vegans out there like vegan gains and all those judgmental stereotypes and things like that keep you know keep pushing a vegan lifestyle in a very unique way you know all are not dogging us meat eaters you know <laughs> but that's one of the things i liked about her videos now the other thing you know that you'll notice when you um that when you look at her videos and things like that is she stutters yes she has a you know she has a very you know bad stuttering that goes on but she, that's that's another reason why she's making her YouTube videos and also it's like, you know, to get herself out there because she used to be one of those who hides in the shadow, who tried to, who tried to hide her stuttering, but now it's like, you know, she's going to embrace it more. You know, she's trying to fix it, but it's like she's just basically getting her story out there, you know, to basically encourage all the people, you know, who do stutter to like, you know, go for it, you know, go, go for it and achieve your dreams and... Don't let anybody or anything stop you from doing what you want to do simply because, you know, you have a, you know, a speech impediment because, you know, you stutter and things like that. And this is me, you know, shouting her out basically because, you know, she is a great inspiration. You know, you know, her story does, you know, need to get out there. And hers just starting out, you know, a month, you know, and also getting to where she is right now. I'm also asking everybody if they can, you know, like, go check her channel out, you know. If you like her, you know, like her videos, subscribe to her and things like that. But just only do me one favor. Do not treat her like a charity case, you know. Do not go over there and feel sorry for her and just be like, oh, you know, like, you know, I'm here to support you, you know, do I am. You know, like, do it because you want to, you know. Don't treat her, I'm saying, don't treat her like she's a special case because that's the last thing, you know, that she really needs to do. She needs to be taken seriously. And that's what I'm doing right now. So, Minka, if you ever get a hold of this, if you ever see this video right here, this is your shout out from your boy Pat. Basically saying, God, Pat, this is all fun and dandy what you're telling her, but you're also missing the important parts. Hello, Minka. Sorry to intrude like this. It's me, Psycho Rick. I am the alternate part of your boy Pat. And I'm here to tell you what he's trying not to tell you. Yes, YouTube can be a very supporting community. But it also has a dark side. There will be people who will come to your videos to make fun of your stutter. 
They're going to poke. They're going to pry. They're going to pick to see if they can get a rise out of you. And some may even accuse your videos of being fake, going like, oh, she's not a real stutterer. She's just only doing this for attention. And I can already tell that you're a very, very smart woman. Do not let these trolls, do not let these agitators do anything to get under your skin. Keep on making your videos. Keep on getting your message out there. And when you do get troll comments, either do two things. Ignore them. Or say, fuck you. <laughs> That's all I have to say. I love your videos. And I think you're like only the one many pe people that can actually make this psychotic motherfucker actually smile. Now, back to what this bitch was saying. Crazy motherfucker always gotta show me up, don't he? Well, anyway, you know, this is your boy Pat along with Psycho Rick saying peace, peace out, out and enjoy. And enjoy. Hi guys, so I just want to make this video about the subject of st stuttering. Now, I stutter myself and I started stuttering when I was about nine years old and n nine or, or, or ten actually, and I never really could figure out why I did st stutter. I, I, I had never had a bad experience when I was young. I had never, I... I never experienced anything traumatic that would make, that could completely change my speech. And growing up, I always had very low confidence because I was always very embarrassed about my voice and I was always very, very traumatically nervous applying for jobs, like, and going to school, um, I would be that kid, like, I, I would never raise my hand in class because I would be so, so nervous to just speak. Um, even hanging out with friends and just having regular small talk to me was a very traumatic thing. Um, it always, it did affect me growing up because I feel like I could have done, like, th there were things that I kind of wanted to do, but I was always afraid to because of my speech. And I was always afraid also of what others would, would think of my, of, think of my speech. And um, on, on and on YouTube, there's not too many videos of pe people who 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 do st stutter on there. So that's why I'm making this video to do because I am going to. I just started my U U YouTube ch ch channel, and I did decide that I'm not going to edit any of my videos where if I stutter, I will edit that part out. So I just want to be extremely real with you with with you guys and I did go to speech therapy when about three years ago I did and I did learn this one technique for me that actually did work most of the time it's where you breathe in and then you very slowly breathe out and as you breathe out you talk on the fl 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 flow of breath like hi my name is so-and-so I am going to go to the park and you just you you, you just kind of practice that practice that fl fl flow of breath and for me when I stutter I find that I stutter when I'm stressed like I, I stutter more when I'm stressed or if I'm really real if or it if I haven't haven't slept well or if I'm really tut 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 tired then I find that that my stuttering is much worse um growing up um it always made me very shy like i was a very shy shy person and if i'm if, I've, if i'm talking one, one on one with someone then i do talk a lot but because of my because of my stuttering i was always very shy to talk in groups even with 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 friends and 
I never really liked like it like when I would talk to a person and they just kind of look at you like if you're on 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 a block like if you can't say a word then they just kind of look look at you with this blank expression <laughs> and it's funny but um so I I just I just wanted to make the, this video though just to let other stutters know or if you have any type of speech impediment or or anything anything like that that you're not 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 alone and I am definitely trying to work on though like feeling good about myself and like not really caring about it much you know because you know I I I, I d d d decided that I didn't want to let it affect my life because it affected it so much when I was a when I was a a, a teen, teen 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 teenager so that's all I have for 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 now and I'll make more videos too on the subject of stu 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 stuttering okay bye Th thank you so much guys Next time on Shout Out, rated R.